TV 18 after this break. Tigers, 5 4 3 2 1. Memorial ball on the 28 yard line. I saw on the 25 yard line. Second and seven. They lead 27 7. And wanting more, they got a two-back backfield. They tend to run out of this two-back backfield. Probably going to give it to McKinley and Warren. They change everything. Changing things from the sideline is what they do. Back to pass. It's going to be a quick screen. and He's caught and loses four yards on that play. <coughs> caught that ball just about the 28, about the 30-yard line, so... It's going to be a loss of yardage on that third and 10. Third and 11. 11.32 11 in the game and counting. Patriots need a big play here to stop him and get off the field. That's maybe two down, two down territory probably. Warren in the backfield with Schleesley. Trips to the near side. Schleesley's going to roll to the near side. He's got incomplete pass. Got that ball to, tried to get that ball out to his tight end, Isaac Hoffman, a big 6'1", 170-pound junior. All these guys are 6'1", 170 pounds, and they all look huge. So fourth and 11, and I think they'll go for it. It's too long to kick it and really too short to punt it. So they're... Twins on both twins on both sides. Warren in the backfield. All they got to do is give it to him. He's been very successful. Change the call at the line of scrimmage from the sideline. Change it right there, according to the Patriots. Schleese's going to go back. He's going to try to pass the screen here. It's missed. That's going to be Patriots going to take over on down. So Harry Chills gets the ball back. Seven to twenty-seven. 11.08 left to go, and Patriots need to get something kick-started here. Still need to try to get that ball down the field and take a shot at the big play every now and then. Doubles to the far side, doubles to the near side. Connor Ding, the lone backfield. Wilkerson takes the ball back. Throws the ball to Steckler. Steckler has it. Picks up about 10, right? Really close. I think he's going to be short of the first down, but it's about a nine-and-a-half-yard pickup. We'll see where they spot it finally. He's going to give him a first down, so 10-yard pickup for Logan Steckler. Logan does a nice job getting off, of, off the ball and getting down the field and then cutting that little in route back in. He's been successful all year with that. Gets it off to Sean Schaefer. Good scramble, and Sean Schaefer takes it down to the 39. Logan Wilkerson, you thought he was dead and wondering what the heck he's doing, tiptoeing around back there, and then just kind of loops it out there to Sean, and Sean did a nice job getting it down to the 39. So down to the Memorial 39, Patriots have a new life. Trips to the near side, Cruz, Steckler, and Collins, and Schaefer to the far side. Logan's going to throw that ball up. Oh, Kenton fell down. He had him, had him, and he just fell down. Just everything going wrong for the Patriots tonight. Kenton trying to adjust to that ball and keep moving at the same time. He turned completely around on it and then, then lost his footing going backwards at about the 10. So second and 10. Patriots still taking that shot, trying to get a quick score every now and then, but, but doing a nice job moving the chains as well. So Steckler out here to the near side. 
Going to be a short catch. Oh, the oh, hook and ladder. Connor being knocked out of bounds at the 20, but the Patriots pick up 15. And ball thrown to Kenton Cruz, and Kenton flipped it to Gabe, and Gabe was coming down the sidelines and got pushed out at the 20. So Memorial adjusted well enough to keep that ball from going, going the distance. Eleven seconds on the play clock. Eight set. Wilkerson back. He's got Steckler. Got Steckler. Touchdown. Touchdown, Logan Steckler from the 24-yard line. Nice pass and nice catch by Logan Steckler. Logan Wilkerson to Logan Steckler. And uh, Patriots come within 14 now and 13 if they can get the PAT. 9.43 left in the game. So, Colin Curtis, the snap is good. The kick is up and good. And the Patriots pull within 13. So, two scores. Patriots still need to make a stop and get the ball back. And still got a long way to go, but at least they're one step closer. Heritage Chills will kick this ball off and probably will squib it and maybe even onside. I don't know if it's early enough to do an onside yet. We're talking about that. Nine forty-three left. We got a long, long way to go in this game, but uh, Memorial has not really showed a penchant to try to to run the clock out either. They throw the ball and keep the clock running, and and uh, had some incompletions. They're still trying to get into the end zone themselves. Memorial's run game has really been what has killed the Patriots tonight. They've run the ball seemingly at will. Uh, they've got a lot of passing yards, but those pass, a lot of those passing yards are from the shovel pass, which is actually passing yards. They look like runs, but they're passes. And they're essentially, they essentially are runs, but uh, technically they're passes. But they've been getting most of their yardage from uh, McKinley Warren, and the Patriots knew that coming in. They needed knew to look for where he's going, but have been unable to stop him. Patriots must be offsides here. So that ball was a kind of a pooch kick there. It's a short kick anyway, but uh, trying to keep it away from Warren, who's explosive. So Colin Curtis will try it again, five yards deeper. So he's kicking from the 35. So Curtis kicks it to the far side, and, and uh, Warren's ended up going to end up getting it anyway. And he's going to run it to the far side. There's a clip. Finally made the call. And uh, Warren is down at the around the 20, but there's a flag down. It's going to be ball's going to be around the 10 or the 9 yard line once this is all said and done. Block in the back. The ball's about the 10 yard line. They put it right on the 10. Memorial back on their heels a little bit. They've got poor field position. They're going to come out in, in doubles. And they've got uh, Warren to that far side. They're going to give it to Shoulders, the fullback, and let him run it up the middle. And he stuffed, but then Patriots can't get him down. They stuffed him. Behind the line of scrimmage, and then just I guess the Patriots are trying to strip the ball, and the 
the Memorial runners are just continuing to move their feet. That's about a four-yard gain. It should have been a two-yard loss. Stripping the ball is a good idea, but you have to get the guy stopped and stood up first, and I, I'm not sure that the Patriots are understanding that right now. Trying to make a big play. Defense desperately trying to make a big play. Doubles. Motion to the near side. They're going to do that little toss pitch. Another, Another flag down. Ball's fumbled, but after he gets out of bounds, and Warren's looks like Warren's hurt maybe, but there's a flag way back, way back at the 11-yard line. Another holding call. So that's a good big play there for the Patriots. Now that shovel pass has been just killing Heritage Chills. They just toss it, just a little toss right in front of them, and, and uh, Warren has been running for miles and miles. He's, Warren is down on this far sideline, and he's on his hands and knees. Memorial finally gets a trainer over here, and it's a, it's a timeout while McKinley Warren catches his breath, and, the, and he's hurt. He's okay. They're giving a thumbs up to the far sideline. So they're going to leave him on this side. I get no, nope, he's going to go across. <laughs> so second and 14, McKinley Warren not going to be in on this play. And they're going to have to try to th see what they do. They're all huddled up there on the goal line and waiting for a call. Memorial. Now the clock is set to go. Schleesley back. He's going to throw the ball. Nope, he doesn't. He rolls out again, rolls out again, and he's going to get the first down and more and is knocked out of bounds at the 26-yard line. Man, the Patriots had him. That, that guy has gotten away several times where the Patriots have had good coverage down the field but then cannot contain the quarterback, and he goes all the way down the field, picks up a bunch. The Patriots had Memorial on their heels there, second and long with their best player on the sideline, and Sleasy makes a huge play. So shoulders in the backfield, a bunch set to the near side. They can run it to this near side. And his shoulders is hit, and he's down, but he picks up three. And the clock continues to run. Second and seven. Now Memorial's trying to do a little clock management. They still got 19 seconds on the play clock. 15, 14. They don't seem to be wanting to run that clock down too much. Ten seconds on the play clock. There's the little pitch. The little shuffle pass, and he picks up eight. Looks like the ball's loose. Andrew Bell had the ball, but they blew the whistle dead. Andrew Bell was running for the end zone. But they'd blown it down. That's shuffle pass. Picks up another five. They threw that one to Javon Langley, Jr., A bunch said again. Third and one. Patriots trying to make a big play here. I'm going to give it to Shoulders, and Shoulders makes the first down. Gets up around the 45. And that'll move the chains. And they'll have another three, three downs to try to ball on the 44, actually. Still a first down. Trips to the near side. Shoulders the 
lone running back, and Shoulders takes it, and he's hit early, but can't can't take him down until he picks up three. He's constantly picking up three on first down. Heritage Chills is hitting him in the backfield, hitting him early, but can't get him down. Second down and six. Getting the calls from the sidelines. Schleese going to throw a quick one to the far side, and he's tackled, hit hard by Andy Sickbert. Uh, Andrew Bell turned him in. The runner turned around, and uh, Andy Sick got a face full of Andy Sickbert. They pick up a couple. It'll be third and about. Didn't get. Didn't really get any gain at all in that play. It'll be third and about seven. And uh, McKinley Warren not in the game. Yep, McKinley Warren back in the game. Bunch set. I'd be watching for him on that little shovel pass. They give it to him, try to get him around the end. He's going to be stuffed. Sam Collins right there. Zach Jones. Sean Schaefer set the corner, and uh, Patriots stuffed that play, and I think Memorial will try to punt now. Memorial's going to punt. Back to punt for Memorial is Jacob Bockelman. 32, Bockelman. Memorial lets it run down to five on the clock. Wobbly punt, got to be fielded by Cruz. Breaks a couple tackles, but can't break them all. He gets to the 30. Picks up about five on that return. So 434 left. Patriots still need a big play to make it get, get in the end zone and not spend a whole lot of time. And they've pulled some plays out of the basement today. Been trying trying all kinds of things to score and just missing. Patriots just missing the big plays. Oh, man, that's a screen pass almost picked off. Man, big number 56, Chase Patton. Had the ball in his hands, juggled around 6'3", 235. Senior there, had, had that, just bobbled it around and couldn't, couldn't bring it down. Thirteen on the play clock. On the uh, it's a little screen pass, little flare pass to the left, and Gabe had some had some room in front of him, but ball thrown low and behind him. Fourteen to twenty-seven here. Thirteen point lead for Memorial. Patriots are third and ten. Got to make a couple plays here to stay on the field. Gabe in the backfield with Zach Jones. Cruz to the far side. Going to be another screen, and they got it to Sablehouse. Sable, oh, he's taken down from behind by 63. That was a nice play. It looked like he had a lot of room, but Dan Durkholtz, 5'8", 205-pound senior, makes the play. It's going to be fourth and seven. Patriots are going to go for it, have to. Two scores down. 4.07 left in this game and counting. Twins to the far side, twins to the near side. Collins and Steckler, Cruz and Schaefer on the far side. Wilkerson back to pass. He's going to throw it to Steckler, and he can't catch it. Logan was knocked down, got it through a little bit too wide there, and it's going to be Patriots turn it over on downs. 
Tigers get the ball again with 3.43 left in this game. Deep in Patriot territory, ball on the 40-yard line. Ball on the 30-yard line. So Warren in the backfield with shoulders, two back offset backfield, two split outs. Give is to Warren, and he's tackled by Andrew Bell. Andrew makes a nice play, but not before Warren picks up eight. Second and two, and Memorial starting to Take a little air out of the clock now. Memorials, to me, has had lots of opportunities to take time off the clock and haven't really done it. But it looks like they're trying to get that ball, run that clock down now. Give us to shoulders the first back through, and he's... Shoulders picks up about five on that one. Six, seven. He picked up about seven. First down, 247 left in this game. Here he comes. Warren is taken down by Baker, but not before he picks up five. We're not getting any angle pursuit at all. We're chasing him down instead of coming at him at the end of the seven. Two, 11 and counting in this game. Second and five. Now Patriots really need to strip. Two backs in the backfield, Shoulders and Warren. Warren has been the killer tonight for the Patriots. The give is going to be to Warren and try to get on the outside, and he's wide open down the field, and he's going to get to the two. So it's going to be first and goal on the two. Memorial knocking on the door, trying to make it a 34-14 game. Give is to Warren. Walks into the end zone. 33 to 14. Minute 28 left in this game. And it's almost over for the Patriots. The season and the game. So Sam Stratman, the senior, 5'8", 160-pound senior, trying to kick the extra point and make it 34 to 14, and he got it. So 34, 14, 128 left in the game. And the Patriots will have one more shot at it to try to at least put some more points on the board. See what Memorial does if they try to kick a line drive or kick it deep. Patriots on the sideline getting their assignments. Memorial on the far sideline trying to figure out what they're going to do. The Cruz, Bell, and Moles are deep. Collins, Jones, and Pund in the second tier. Looks like Bustler, Durham, Nix, Wilson, and Briar Bryant on the front line. 
Not Briar Bryant. Ross Dilger. Kick is rolled up. Collins is going to have a hold of it and come to the near side and stuffed at the 32-yard line. And see what Harry Chills does if they try to go ahead and get down the field. Minute 22 left, down by 20. Twins to the twins to the far side, twins to the near side. <coughs> Gabe Connerding out of the game. It's going to be Jacob Poon, and he's going to get the corner. Try to run out of bounds and gets out of bounds at the 46-yard line. Nice run by Jacob. Picks up about 13, maybe 14. 14-yard gain. That's uh, something for the Patriots to look forward to. Jacob Poon. A sophomore, nice, nice sophomore there doing some nice running. Twins on both sides. Collins and Steckler, Cruz and Schaefer. Wilkerson's going to throw it up in the air. He's going to try to throw it. Almost caught by, tipped and bobbled around and almost caught by Schaefer, but I don't know if he'd have been in bounds or not. 109 last. Patriots still trying to get down the field as best they can. Twins to the far side again. Twins to the near side. Into the boundary. Give is to Pun and he's got some room outside. He cuts it up, picks up 12. Heritage Chills will have a chance to get another couple plays off. Pun picks up 12. Jacob's got some good yardage tonight. Fifty-two seconds and counting. Wilkerson gonna give it to Pun, and Pun's gonna get to the near side. Gonna get out of bounds. It's a holding there. They're gonna call a holding on Durham. Zach Durham was falling down and sort of grabbed a hold of his his assignment. That's going to be about a 20. First and 21. See what the Patriots do. If we're going to take a knee or keep plugging away. 41 seconds left. I'm going to give it to Pun up the middle, and he's got some yards, and he's going to. Drop down, picks up about eight on that one, maybe seven, 30 seconds. That's going to be the last play of the game, I think. Patriots are not going to, maybe they're going to try to get one more off. <laughs> 20 seconds and counting on the play clock and game clock at 12 seconds. Logan's going to try to get one off, probably give it right to, Jacob, Jacob's got some room. He's got to the outside. He's going to turn it up to sidelines and get knocked out at the 20, but that's going to be it. The game's going to be over. Patriots lose this one to Memorial, 14-34. to Offense didn't get going at all until the second half, and it was too little too late. I'm Michael Cruz for WJTS-TV 18. We'll be right back after this break for a 